let's have a look at the customer return analysis we are offering in this solution. Now, first of all, a comprehensive dashboard is there where you can have a look how much is the return quantity, amount, or return percent. If you compare with the previous year, like to like YTT period, how much is the growth, degrowth percent after the company level? Now, maybe there is some division where the return is more or some vendors are there, the problematic vendor, those products are being returned or the month-wise trend for the return amount, current year, previous year, maybe for some consecutive month, significant return is there. So that may be an issue. And after that, the site-wise performance, site-wise return quantity, amount, return percent, maybe for a particular site, the return is more. So from the trend, you can have to do for some specific site, the return is above the average return amount or maybe some products are there where the return is more. So you can have the glimpse of how the customer are returning and the pattern of their return at various level. Now, after that, the details reports are there where you can have the details analysis at various site product level or vendor level. So along with the sale, how much is the return, return percent? So you can have the details report at various levels. And after that, some exceptional scenarios where the return percent is greater than a specific person. Now here, let's say I want to identify those items where the return is alarmingly high. So here I have given 10. That means I want to identify those items where the return percent is greater than 10%. So you can clearly identify the problem area, the site, product, or maybe some specific vendors where the return is alarmingly high.